SOLIDWORKS Design 2026 brings smart updates to the assembly environment that will make your workflows faster and more efficient. Let's take a look at what's new. When working in assemblies, you often need to make cosmetic changes to components, like adding or modifying reference geometry. In SOLIDWORKS 2026, a new assembly save indicator now appears when only cosmetic changes are made, so you'll know the top-level assembly doesn't need to be saved. This can help you avoid unnecessary saves, so you can save time. And this isn't limited to creating reference geometry. It also includes modifying, hiding, or even deleting it, as long as those changes don't affect downstream features. Other supported operations in split view include creating, editing, hiding, or even deleting unabsorbed sketches and adding decals onto parts. However, this enhancement isn't limited to making changes in this side-by-side -side view. Editing in the context of the assembly is fully supported. We can edit a part's appearance. We can even modify a feature as long as we don't confirm the change. And as long as no physical changes were made, when you go to save in SOLIDWORKS 2026, it will now clearly notify you that the components need to be saved, but the top level assembly doesn't. Managing configurations and display states is essential for creating the right assembly views. And in SOLIDWORKS 2026, it's more efficient. Display states let you hide, show, or recolor components without the performance overhead of configurations. Now, display state tables will render quickly, and columns are fully resizable, and text wraps automatically for easier readability. Reference display states and components are easier to manage now that the row is enabled and disabled consistently through the dropdown. Global Hide Show is also more reliable across the board. Now working with configuration tables is also more streamlined. When you double click a component in the graphics area, only the suppress column is shown by default now in 2026. This will keep things clean. Other columns like configuration and fixed are still available via the dropdown, and any column can be removed by toggling the checkbox or with a quick right click. These updates make managing complex assemblies simpler, cleaner, and faster. Utilizing the SOLIDWORKS toolbox is a great way to manage and add fasteners to assemblies, saving time on a repetitive task but not every company chooses to use it. Now, SOLIDWORKS 2026 leverages AI to automatically recognize and mate fasteners, even without mate references. In this example, fasteners from a company-made library of parts with no built-in mate helpers are positioned and mated with a simple drag and drop, no matter their origin. Even fasteners downloaded from a supplier website can now be mated automatically, making this everyday workflow faster. Lastly, let's look back at an enhancement introduced in SOLIDWORKS 2025 Functional Delivery 2. Expanding a lightweight subassembly or component in previous years automatically resolved that component, causing delays. Now, there is a system option that allows us to disable the auto-resolve of components upon expansion. This will provide improved performance when you're exploring the feature tree in lightweight mode. That concludes our overview of the latest assembly enhancements in SOLIDWORKS 2026. Be sure to check out our full series of What's New videos to see what else SOLIDWORKS Design 2026 has to offer.